All right guys, I'm gonna try to make this video pretty quick. So this video is how to make those seamless Instagram collages that you see a lot. I've seen a few of these videos on YouTube. Um, I mean, I figured it out before I looked it up. I just wanna see if there was a need to create this video, but they were either too long or they're like more efficient ways of doing it in my opinion. So this is how I do it. I do it in Photoshop, so let's just get started. So before we make the actual document, uh, you have to realize about like Instagram ratios and stuff. So the aspect ratio to fill up the whole screen is four by five. And I looked up like what is the optimal amount of pixels and they said 1080 by 1350, which is four by five. For example, if you want like five of them, you're gonna do 1080 times five, which is uh, 5,400. So we're gonna go to the width right here and do 5,400. And then for height, 1350, like I said, resolution, 300 pixels per inch, uh, RGB, 8-bit. You're gonna like lay out your images and stuff. I'm not gonna go over it because that's not that important. Uh, you can lay it out however you want. Uh, but to actually like make it ready for Instagram, you do view and then you do new guide layout. And then however many like columns, that's a better word to use, you wanted, uh, you do like five. So I, like I said, I wanted five. And then for rows, you always do one and do okay. And you go to this tool right here, the slice tool. And then you click slices from guides and there. And then you do save for web. And then it'll ask you all slices like right here. And you just press save and it saves all of them. So I'm gonna be going over an example really quickly. Uh, so I showed you how to do it, but like this is just an example. So I think like putting pictures in this format is already pretty sick. Um, it's like, I guess now it's pretty saturated, but uh, it's still like a unique way to share your photos, I think in a collage way and share multiple of them instead of just like sharing photo by photo by photo, which is fine. But you know, if you wanna be like different or you're like creative or whatever, uh, but to take it up another level, in my opinion, is to like add some designs and stuff. And I go over some of these principles in my uh, magazine texture video, uh, link in the description. But yeah, just adding like, words and adding like paint, whatever, just to make it more interesting. And yeah.